The Draw On page extension allows us to easily draw on any website with simple drawing tools and print the result as well as taking an image snapshot. To get started with this extension, simply add it to your browser. Upon adding it to your browser, you can then left click and pin it to the browser toolbar as well. Now it shows inside the browser toolbar. If we go ahead and left click this, we will see the options panel open. Inside this panel, we have lots of different options available, such as different colors for the line and the fill objects, background stroke and shadow colors as well. You then have further tools here. Ultimately, this tool comes with two different brush types, one to draw lines by default is selected and the other to draw shapes, as we can see here. On top of this, we have the ability to change lots of different elements, such as the thickness, the stroke, adding a shadow effect, offsetting the shadow, the opacity, so making it more translucent or transparent, and the same for shapes as well. We can change the colors of the objects. and the color of the lines as well. On the left hand side, you see the option to show and hide the options bar, an undo button, a redo button, the ability to save the page as an image or a snapshot image, and the ability to print as well. Inside the options panel, you'll see the options below to copy, paste, remove, clear all the drawings, save all the drawings, change the color of the app, and then hide the controls as well. So one good example of this tool that you may use in real use is for example, studying. Let's say you are looking at an article, such as this article here on Wikipedia, and you're looking to highlight elements to then print off and further study. So you go ahead and choose your highlight color. So we'll stick with the classic yellow and we'll add a slight opacity effect to this as well. So we'll go to the line tool and then the opacity behind this. Then we can highlight specific areas. So for example, we might highlight a date. We realize that's too large. So we go back, we remove all of the shadow and we make the brush a lot smaller. Let me try now. There we go. So we might highlight the date here or you may like to make it smaller and highlight the other element here. And you can go through and highlight all those different areas as highlighted. Overall, this is a very handy tool with lots of different elements inside to really customize how you wish to draw on the page.